Hey everybody, my name is Ethan Rossman. I have the privilege of being the Rec Driver for 2021, and I'm gonna walk you through a day in the life of the Rec Driver on Homecoming Weekend. is a tricycle race around Peter's parking deck. It started back in the 60s when pledges were made to ride tricycles around campus. And then in 1969, it became an official Georgia Tech homecoming event where teams of seven compete to race around Peter's parking deck. They have to complete eight laps on a tricycle that can only be modified in a few different ways. Every year, the race is led by the wreck. So my job is to stand in front of the, or park in front of the starting line. And when I hear the gun go off, I take off as fast as I can because some of the trikes are so well engineered, they'll actually beat the wreck off the line. It's a lot harder than you expect. It is quite the quad workout. Um, the course looks like it's pretty flat, but once you're on it, it is very much uphill for a lot of the race. It feels like it's been hours out here. Once I get to Freshman Hill, I turn around backwards, and then it's just a quad workout to the finish. Here we go. Feeling pretty good. We started setting up the race around four in the morning uh, and the freshman cake race is going to start around six o'clock is check-in, 6.30 I think is the race. So all the freshmen are waking up now, the band is going around blasting them out of their beds with the fight songs. They'll be trickling over here, queuing up behind the start line and then running as fast as they can to see who can win the cake this year. Once again, the wreck is going to be leading the race. Um, in the front of the pack are usually the fastest runners and once again, they're going to be pretty tough to beat off the line. Three, two, one. Shift up into second. So we're getting ready to lead the rec parade. Um, it's an awesome tradition with classic cars, contraptions, fixed bodies, and then a lot of different spirit elements. The rec for Halloween this year is dressed up as Buzz, and Buzz is dressed as the rec. So we're tidying up our costume here, making sure all the clips are nice and neat. So this part's all easy because we're going downhill. So I'm just kind of on the brakes. Once it flattens out too much to roll, I'll have to like actually put it in first gear, drive a little bit, put it back in neutral and roll. to the middle of Freshman Hill for Yellow Jacket Alley, which is where the players arrive. The rec leads a procession down the hill, which includes the rec, followed by the cheer and gold rush, followed by the band, followed by all the players. And the players enter in the stadium past the rec and the band, and then we zoom around to visit some tailgates. The cool part about Yellow Jacket Alley is hearing the drum line do their warm-ups. So maintaining a walking pace is Kind of difficult. <laughs> it's a lot of guesswork. Yeah. I think we're doing okay. I headed up to Harrison Square to visit some of the tailgates up there. Go Jackets! Of course. We are headed to do one final lap around tailgates, and then we're going to the top of Freshman Hill for the entrance into the stadium. The wreck got wet, and then we dried her off, which is kind of like washing. But I usually start with all the stuff that's shiny because that's the stuff that gets water stained the first from the drops. Hopefully we can get everything shiny, go do the parade into the stadium before it rains again, and we'll look nice and good today. So every year at homecoming, Red Club will shotgun a Red Bull because we've been staying up all night planning everything. And so we are about to go shotgun a Red Bull in honor of that tradition. See, the 
people in gold jackets down there clearing this turn. We're gonna make the turn and go right into the stadium. And the second we start to make the turn, I throw it in second gear. Everyone in the lines is gonna run behind us and we all sprint in. All right, here we go. The ride out is really fun. It's a really high energy moment. Uh, you see the queuer with the headset count you down three, two, one, and then you go and you see the flag runners with the flags, the fire coming out of the tunnel, um, and then it looks like there's just chaos on the field, and then a small channel opens up that you drive through, um, and the next thing you know, you're parked on the other side. It's like if you're playing for mission. events this morning kind of build the game a little bit more so there's a lot more anticipation for the game um, but it's really fun to get to see people who I looked up to when I was a first year now back kind of cheering me on as I drive the wreck it's really exciting.